Her throat was slit. She was able to wrestle away, getting even more cuts in the process. Stitches at the hospital and a trauma. The seven year old little girl hasn't even processed yet. A guy came up to me. He was like that. And then he got one hand. He had had anything on his hand. He did like pull my face up. And then he the other hand was like a knife. And he he just like came out of nowhere and just slide the knife on me. Seven year old Seda Mazra at a park on Detroit's far west side this week with her grandma attacked at random by a 73 year old man. When he came towards my grandma, I ran home and then and then my grandma was screaming what 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 everybody was saying like knife knife knife, but she didn't understand. So I told her in the Arabic so she could know. Seda kicked him and ran to her nearby home showing mom what he'd done, slashed her throat and tried to puncture her stomach with a pocket knife. His hair was gray. Here was hair and here was hair, but the middle was bald. Seda describing her alleged attacker, Gary Lansky, now charged with assault with intent to murder and assault with a deadly weapon. When neighbors saw what happened at Ryan Park, they jumped in, corralling Lansky until police got there. When we went out to the park, I mean, the children there, they were just horrified. They were traumatized. Detroit Police Commander Vernell Newsom says Lansky was oddly calm when he was arrested. We figured that he perhaps had some type of uh, breakdown or was experiencing a, a mental uh, crisis. The elderly man facing additional charges for domestic violence against his wife before this attack. I'll tell him you're a very mean guy and you're a very a bad guy because I wish you never came out of the prison. It came out in court today that Lansky also allegedly used a knife in that domestic violence attack on his wife and sister in regards to the case. With little Seda, he was given a $2 million cash bond. Jessica Dupnak, Fox 2 News.